But just like last week, no action was taken at tonight's closed session. In the meantime, all eyes are on tomorrow's coronavirus numbers to be issued by the state, numbers that will determine if we fall into the state's most restrictive purple tier. I want you to know I will be your voice of reason in that closed session hearing. Leading up to this evening's closed Board of Supervisors session, in which county leaders discussed their legal options should San Diego be relegated to Tier 1 tomorrow, Supervisor Jim Desmond made his stance clear. I'm going to fight to continue to keep businesses open, businesses open safely in San Diego County. We can fight the virus and be open for business. Hours earlier, in the same location in front of the county administration building. Reality, it is. COVID-19 that is attacking our community. Supervisor Nathan Fletcher, surrounded by a team of local medical professionals, called for caution and scientific reasoning in the county's response to the COVID crisis. In particular, Supervisors Jim Desmond and Kristen Gaspar are inciting a fight between government and small business. It is reckless and irresponsible leadership. Supervisor Kristen Gaspar shot back, writing in response, quote, let me set the record straight. I have never supported any approach to reopening that was not specifically supported by our public health officer and clinical leadership team. Following tonight's closed meeting, Chairman Greg Cox promised, quote, we will continue to work with the state to make sure the metrics accurately reflect the underlying dynamics of the pandemic in San Diego County. If we do fall into the most restrictive purple tier, indoor activities at restaurants, movie theaters, gyms, and houses of worship will be curtailed. Last week, some county leaders had pushed for excluding SDSU's coronavirus cases, now at 880, to bring down the county's overall case rate and keep the county securely in the red tier, a move the governor nixed. And we expect to hear from state leadership tomorrow at noon as to what those updated coronavirus numbers are for San Diego County, determining whether or not we fall into Tier 1. CBS 8 will be airing that live. We'll also be covering it on CBS8.com.